So here we have our demo account which is DM online December 2015 at gmail.com. So this is our Google AdWords demo account we used for creating a campaign, right? So this is the customer ID of this Google AdWords account, okay? Here, okay. Assume you have multiple AdWords account, okay? So you are running a group of companies and you have multiple websites and you are maintaining uh, each and every website under, under different AdWords account, okay? So you have multiple AdWords account or assume you are an ad agency and uh, you know you want to add you want to maintain multiple clients uh, you want to maintain multiple clients accounts under single account okay so to do this you need to sign up for google adwords my client center account okay google adwords account is different from google adwords my client center account okay mcc my client center Google AdWords My Client Center account is a it's a user interface it's an user interface under which under which you can maintain multiple Google AdWords account okay so let's create Google AdWords My Client Center account and we can add this specific AdWords account under that MCC okay and we can also add one more live account under our MCC account okay to create Google AdWords MCC account, you need to have a new Gmail ID and password. So let's create new Gmail ID and password first. File. I'm going to open a new window. So I'm going to create new account, new Gmail account. DM online DEC MCC, my client center account. So we have a new Gmail created. Say continue to Gmail. You open a new tab. We are going to use this new Gmail ID to sign up for Google AdWords My Client Center account. Okay. Please note again, Google AdWords account is different from Google AdWords My Client Center account. Please don't use your existing Gmail which you have already used for signing up for Google AdWords account. Here it is a new account for new account that we are going to use for MCC setup okay type google adwords my client center here can you see this my client center okay this is google adwords manager accounts okay formerly my client center or MCC okay click on this link and sign up okay if you scroll down in the screen you can see sign up click on sign up using this account you will be able to manage multiple adwords account this is just a user interface okay in this screen type your name of your account um say i want to say loxy training so this is, I'm going to use it for managing other people's accounts and choose your country, time zone and currency and say yes I agree, say I will continue. Okay, so here we go, we have a Google AdWords My Client Center ready, okay. My Client Center will also have customer ID which is displayed here, okay. This is DM online December 2015. This is the AdWords account that we use to create our campaigns. Okay. You need to copy this customer ID. Okay. It's like this. You will request your client. You will request your client to pass on their customer ID to you. Now you as an ad agency, you are going to add this AdWords account to your MCC. Okay. So I'm going to have opened this MCC account now. Click on this plus account, link existing accounts, and add your customer ID. Okay. 
your AdWords customer ID. You can even add another MCC's customer ID here. Okay, so in this case, another MCC will become a sub MCC of this parent MCC. Okay, so now we are going to add one AdWords account. Click on continue. Name this account. I'm going to name this as uh, training demo. Okay, and say request approval. Once you say request approval, this request will reach your client. Okay. Now let's see and let's go back to our AdWords account and see whether we have received this uh, request. So I'm currently in the AdWords account. Click on gear icon. Go to account settings. Here, click on account access. Okay, here you will have this request from your Loxy training MCC's request. Click on accept request. Click on OK. Okay. Done. Now you go back to your MCC account. I'm in my MCC account. Refresh the screen. Can you see this? You have your training demo AdWords account added to this MCC account. Similarly, you can add multiple AdWords account. Okay, say I'm going to add one more live account, which is our Vibavi.com's account. So this is Vibavi's account, Vibavi's AdWords account. As you, we are an ad agency. We have MCC account, and Vibavi is our client. Okay, in this case. We are going to request Vibavi to uh, send their customer ID, which is nothing but this. So I'm going to copy this, okay? And as you might, I have sent an email to the, the ad agency. I'm back to MCC account now, plus account, link existing account. Continue. I'm going to save Vibavi here. Request approval and I am in Vibavi's account now. Click on build, um, sorry, uh, gear icon, account settings. Click on account access. Okay, click on accept request. Okay, MCC. Now let's go back to our MCC, refresh the screen. So refresh the screen, you will have a rivalry account added here. Okay, can you see this? So now you can click on any of this account and you can view their accounts from this MCC account. Okay, so it's a user interface using which you can manage multiple accounts okay your client can be from any countries so under this mcc you can manage multiple accounts multiple address accounts you know from worldwide so you can view this account from here you will have user and api access which is like an admin minus user management control okay so here, if you click on this drop down, you can go to any other accounts you have. Okay. Assume you have hundreds of AdWords accounts. Okay. And you want to assign teams. Okay. Say four teams to manage this hundreds of uh, AdWords account. What you can do is you can create four sub mcc account sub mcc is nothing but mcc accounts okay you will create four new gmail ids sign up for four mcc account with those four new gmail ids and you already have a, a parent account with you now you will add those four mcc accounts customer id under this parent id okay and under four mcc account you, you will you will be able to add respective adwords account okay now 
you will have as a parent MCs, you will have access to all hundred hundreds of account all these hundred accounts and sub MCC will have only the access to only those respective accounts okay so assume you have 20 accounts added under number 1 MCC and number 2 MCC has only 15 and the remaining has the remaining accounts access okay so the first account will have only those 20 access to only those 20 adverse accounts okay but as a parent MCC you will have all hundreds access to all hundred adverse accounts okay